Hi, beautiful Sagittarius. My name is Trudy Healy, and welcome to Beacons of Angel Light. This is your February romance reading uh, for 2019, and this is for Sagittarius Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. We're using uh, the Psychic Tarot for the Heart Oracle deck by John Holland. So let's get right into it. Psh, psh, psh. This is, by the way, for February. Oh, you have two main energies. Okay. Uh, this is going to be for February, you know, Valentine's Day special for the rest of the month of February. So it's like win or lose. Oftentimes when I see this card, it makes me think of Excalibur. It's like you are still the one. Whether they are the one for you or not, you are still the one. You're Excalibur. Only one person gets to walk away with Excalibur. Right, so that's the main energy. Also, we have a solar plexus uh, romance. Like, this is dictating the romantic vibe for the following two weeks is your gut instinct. Your solar plexus is right in your center of your body and it radiates yellow. And so this is definitely very dominant energy for you here, Sagittarius. Now, uh, let's see what the blockage is to overcome. Opportunity is beckoning and you're turning away from it. You don't want anything to do with it or you do, but you're not sure. And there's all of this uncertainty and you're just feeling like, ah, oh, you can't. It's overwhelming you. You're Yeah, overwhelmed and feeling flustered, right? So let's see what the other person, oh, that just came out really quickly. <laughs> the person that you're dealing with here, uh, that's funny. You guys are mirroring each other because we have here uh, four and a four, right? But they're of a different spectrum. So this four is you're turning away from it, but it is balance, okay? You probably have really good reason for this. This is a joy and stability, and this is balance. It's depicted here as the female with the circles. I would traditionally go with more circ uh, a square because of the balance of the four corners, but what it is trying to, with the circles here, it's a very feminine, nourishing energy of like almost the womb, again, same color as the solar plexus. Uh, it's intuition, it's, uh, this is more like sacral chakra, it's birthing and uh, nurturing. So the joy and stability here is with the other person, their blockages, they're having a hard time acknowledging the joy and stability. Yeah, it's there but they're off tune. Okay. Then, so that's the blockage, the advice. The advice for you, Sagittarius. Flow, just go with the flow and the advice for your counterpart here. You have to flow with things. You have to flow with things like water and stop being so rigid. You want me to stress this to you. You're really like stuck in your ways and they're saying for you to just go with it. Stop, be, stop being so difficult. Um, that's not like you. You're very, usually you're very playful, but in this particular situation, you're, so they're saying be more like water. And this person needs to uh, make a decision here. They're daydreaming all of the time and they do need to make a decision. Perhaps in regards with that joint stability, um, but I'm feeling like there is a third influence here. Uh, so let's see what it is that you're keeping up from your counterpart, Sagittarius. We have here refusing to see, and let's see what they're keeping from you. Oh, we got two cards here. All right, so in your case, what you're keeping from them is that you're refusing to see things from their perspective. You are being stuck and rigid and not flowing and you're refusing to see 
their truth. And then this person, what they're not telling you is about their daydreams and what they're manifesting. Um, because they really do want to come together with you and create some joy and stability with you, but you're not open to it. <laughs> and they are very, very determined. So this is like your ships coming in. This person is reliable and successful and steady ever forward like a ship. All right. Uh, so let's see what the outcome is. For you, Sagittarius. <laughs> this one's gonna be shared. Outcome for February. No, they said that's not it. Hold on. Outcome for February 2019, but that's definitely it. Ooh, heart chakra. So you guys are connecting on a very, very soul level. I want to say this person is a soulmate. Perhaps, if some of you are familiar with it and are open to it, I'm not saying everybody, some of you, I really don't like to throw this around, but some of you may be twin flames with this person. Past life relationship, it's not a karmic situation, it's an affair of the heart chakra. So the heart chakra is definitely going to be active and open at the end of the month as opposed to you here turning away. All right, so I do hope that you enjoyed that. Sagittarius, I love you so very much. Love yourself and love everybody around you. Mwah.